Well, it's been 52 years since two self-described wannabe Glen Morgan artists decided to form an art group to give the region's artists and creative talents an outlet and a chance to work together with like-minded souls and learn from each other. Since then, the group has grown, evolved and gone from strength to strength. And this weekend, an exhibition by both the Glen Morgan and Toowoomba Art Groups called Looking Forward, Looking Back – opens at Dolby's Gallery 107. Jane Bridie is the founder of the Glen Morgan Art Group. Good morning, Jane. Good morning, Vicky. How are you? Well, thanks. Now, two years ago, the Glen Morgan Art Group marked its 50th birthday with an exhibition looking back at the members' works from the past 50 years. But with the title of Looking Forward, Looking Back, it sounds like this exhibition is another chance to look back. Is that the case? Uh, yes, yes, it is. Where um, we have uh, paintings in there, artworks that are uh, current as well as a couple of years old. Um, yes, definitely. Now, this is a collaboration between Glen Morgan and the Toowoomba Art Group. How did that come about? Well, a few of us who belong to the Glen Morgan Art Group, we've been members, some of us have been members for 50 years, over 50 years of the Glen Morgan Art Group, we retired to Toowoomba and we missed our companionship and our, you know, the ability to go out and paint. So we decided that we'd get together and form a painting group, which we did. And because we've, you know, sort of been part of the Glen Morgan Art Group, it seemed sort of a no-brainer not to go with the, the title Toowoomba Art Group. So we called the Glen Morgan Art Group GAG, and we are TAG. <laughs> <laughs> GAG and TAG. And look, yes. by the way you're, you're describing it, it sounds like it's more than just an art group. It sounds like it's a real social function for people. Well, it, it's more than a social function. It's, uh, it's really a, a wonderful way of painting because that's our thing. Um, we all love our painting um, but it's it's a long time friendships, um, you know, companionships. Uh, it gives us sort of impetus and, and focus. Um, so many so many benefits, connections with each other and and with our past. Now tell us how you went about selecting the works that are going to be on exhibit. Well, uh, it was really just up to the uh, artists to decide what they wanted to to show. We we sort of had to keep the numbers down because the the old Dolby Gallery 107 is no more, and so we they've moved to a new location in Marble Street, 23 Marble Street, and it's a smaller gallery. It's the Dolby Arts Centre, uh, so we couldn't have a huge number of works where there are 35 in this one, which is going to be capacity for the, the little art gallery. Um, but it will be a really, really good show. Hmm. The official opening is this Saturday afternoon at two o'clock. Is the public welcome to that official opening or is it for invited guests only? No, no, definitely the public are invited, but there's one proviso they really must register on Eventbrite, it's not. It's a, they're free tickets, but just for catering purposes. And I've the best way to do that is to search on the net, uh, looking forward, looking back, Dolby Eventbrite, and that should take you straight to the link, and you can book your ticket there, your free ticket. How long was the exhibition going to be on for? It's on until the fourth of May. So there's plenty of time for people to get in there and, and see it. The gallery is open uh, Monday to Friday, 10 till 2, Saturday, 9.30 till 12.30, closed on Sunday and public holidays. Sounds like it's a fabulous collaboration between gag and tag. I love that. Yes, yes. <laughs> and it also sounds like it's a fantastic way for people to get together, have a chat as well as do mm -hmm. something that they're very passionate about. Oh, yes, well, we certainly do do that. Yeah, All right. it's wonderful. Look, thanks for telling us a little bit about it. I really appreciate your time this morning and good luck with the exhibition, Jane. Thank you so much, Vicky. Great to talk to you.
That's Jane Bridie. She's one of the founders of the Glen Morgan Art Group, or GAG, as you just heard, teaming up with the Toowoomba Art Group, TAG, for that exhibition opening this Saturday at Dolby's Gallery 107. No cost to go to the opening, but you do need to register for your ticket. So just search on Eventbrite for Looking Forward, Looking Back and Dolby and you'll find it just for catering purposes. And as she said, it's open until the 4th of May. So plenty of time if you want to look at some great artwork. Do yourself a favour, get out there and have a look.